So I'm on the hunt for another copper mine today. And this time I'm in my own backyard. I'm literally just one town over. And I went out looking for this mine probably a few years ago. I've been looking for it for a while, but uh, I've always been kind of walking these woods and never found any really definitive clues. And I don't really know much about this mine. All I really know is that it was mined before the Civil War by an English company. And it was reopened again after that, but it was unprofitable and it was closed. Um, so I'm just kind of looking around out here for any clues based on a LIDAR map that I pulled up of the area. So to my left is Copper Mine Road. So I'm just heading back through the woods here on my way to some really intriguing LIDAR anomalies, some nice little mounds, possibly tailings. So I never quite went this far when I was going out looking for it in the past, so I am in some new territory now, which is a good thing. So we'll see what we find. It's an incline. an original copper mine that dates to before the Civil War still had the tracks in the water, under the water table. That water table probably stayed pretty consistent throughout, throughout the last hundred or so years because the tracks would have been pulled up if it was ever any lower. And it was just an incredible mine. I couldn't believe the seeing the green copper in the wall and the fact that an incline is still enterable. Usually they're flooded right up to the surface. So that was a, a big success and all thanks to LIDAR, um, I went right to the coordinate on that and saw the opening and I knew I found it. Very exciting find. So I guess I'll see what else there is out there to find using LIDAR. A lot of these sites are still out there um, just waiting to be found. And now with LIDAR, we can find them. Mm -hmm. 